Hey, buddy, I hope you're ready for an epic summer, because I've got it all planned out. Do you? Because last year you got us lost in the Everglades on a nematode hunt. That wasn't my fault. How was I supposed to know there's alligators in the Everglades? Just... Tell me the plan. Okay, so you know about World Anvil, right? The online set of world building tools that helps writers and game masters create, organize, and store their worlds? Chaz, um, World Anvil has been one of our sponsors for years. Ah, so you probably already knew that you can cross-reference world info with wiki-like articles, make interactive maps, historical timelines, diplomacy webs, and organizational charts. Yeah. It's like the features never end. Family trees, bloodlines, random generators, world building prompts, an RPG game manager, and organizational capability so advanced it doubles as a novel writing software. What does all this have to do with summer? I'm going to use World Anvil to recreate a map of the Everglades. That way when we go nematode hunting this summer, we won't get lost. Build, secure, and showcase your world with World Anvil. Click the link in the description or go to worldanvil.com and use the promo code MANSHORTS to get 40% off any of the annual memberships. Man shorts. I'm pretty amazed this is the 16th time we've done this, but then again, we still live here, so I guess we're numb to the madness. Numb to the madness should be our state motto. I mean, Whalen didn't even want to play this week. I'm not sure I can blame him. You actually thought about making jokes about our state government, but it occurs to me, nothing about that is funny. Lucky for us, the sunshine law exists. For now. Just wait until they pave our roads with radioactive waste. The sooner you roll initiative, the sooner we can be done with this. 17. 13. 10. All right, Lance. Let her rip. I'm gonna go swimming in the creek. With my clothes on. I feel like that's not all. Definitely not. I'm also gonna feed an alligator a sandwich. Are you trying to die? Okay, Robocop. I don't care if it's against the law or whatever. It's cool, and I'm doing it. Okay, it's not cool, and not only is it illegal, but it's really dangerous because it teaches alligators to associate humans with the availability for food. So do I have to roll or something? Dexterity save, disadvantage. 15 and 15. You succeed in feeding the alligator, but that doesn't mean that anyone else should. I'm definitely doing Sarah. Before I do anything, I need to order some GBL. <sighs> that sounds illegal. Oh, it's legal to buy. Some people call it liquid ecstasy. What the heck is this stuff? Ooh, one guy called it coma in a bottle. Yeah, that's probably because it's a chemical compound of GHB. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take six gallons. Okay, give me a percentile roll, I guess. 48. Yeah, that delivery's gonna get stopped by customs. <sighs> Unbelievable. Same. I'd thank you for taking Wayland's spot this week, but I got a feeling you're about to make me angry, so let's just do that. There's a romantic rival in the neighborhood. I'd like to go smash up his car. Sure. You creep through the darkness and approach the car. Roll your attack. Nat 20. How do you want to do it? I'm going to kick the driver's side mirror, and then, and then I'm going to break the passenger side windshield wiper. Whoa. Crazy. Wait a minute. There's one more thing I got to do. I thought so. I'm pooping on the roof. I don't even know how you would roll for that, so we'll just say you did it. Good enough for me. Back to you, Gator Whisperer. I need to get some stuff at the Jiffy. What kind of stuff? I'm gonna get dog food, antifreeze, a three-pack of cigarillos, and a watermelon breeze disposable vape. Mm -hmm. And I assume you'll be stealing these items, is that correct? Indeed I am. That's a 12 on my steal stuff check. You get all the things on your list, but during the robbery, you drop your debit card. Perfect. Y you realize they're going to know you robbed the store. Oh, uh-uh, no. I'm going to tell the police that I left the card behind to pay for the stuff. Why do I keep doing this? What are you doing? Just driving around. Speeding. You hit a red light. A cop who saw you speeding has pulled up behind you now and turned his lights on, indicating that you need to pull over. I'll wait for the light to turn green, and then I'll pull over on the side of the road. Uh, okay, so to be clear, you're stopping your vehicle. Yep. The cop exits his cruiser and starts approaching your car. I'm driving away. 16. Uh, okay, the cops are going to chase after you. Give me a flea check. 24. Sarah somehow evades the police, which actually says a lot more about them than you. Justin? I'm pretty hungry, so I guess I'll go to a restaurant, 
get drunk and then harass people. Wow, that sounds rude. Yeah, I'm just going to be a general disturbance. The management has asked you to leave. You shouldn't have done that, friend. What does that mean? I got a 19 to shoot into the restaurant. I can't even pretend to be surprised. You fire off 10 rounds into the restaurant with 25 people in it. Thankfully, no one is injured. I'm hurt. They kicked me out of the restaurant. Land this plane crash. I'm still in a hearse. Where is this going? Nowhere in particular. Hearses are just cool. I'm going to weave in and out of traffic. Recklessly. Give me a drive check. Three. You crash, causing a seven-car pileup. The police will arrive shortly and arrest you. For what? Sarah, you're up. Well, I went to McDonald's, but no one asked if I was using the app. Are they supposed to? If they don't, I'm supposed to get a free cookie. I'm going to go ahead and pull my gun. In the restaurant? What? No, I'm in the drive-thru. 26 to intimidate? Yeah, you terrify everyone in the restaurant. Although when the police arrive, a cookie will be the least of your concerns. Oh, I'm getting my cookie. You want to wrap this up? I decided to get naked and break into some houses. The police are chasing after you. Give me a resist arrest check. 17. While trying to get away, you fall into the pool. And when trying to get out of the pool, you slip and fall on a trampoline. The cop behind you screams out, I'm warning you, I'll tase you. A lifeguard is what I am. Four officers manage to finally restrain you. One of them asks why you're so slippery. Well, I'm just covered in blood, peppermint oil, and wheel bearing grease. So We're done. That's quite enough. What an absolute nightmare this place is. Well, yeah, but to be fair, it's always been this way. That's true. We are consistent. Any plans for next week? Oh, I've got pretty big plans for next week. Big plans. Are you rolling? Whoa! That was a quick cut speed. Yeah. Do you want me to reference it at all? No. Okay. Melissa wasn't feeling well this week. Jay replaced her. And then Rigsby had scheduling issues this week, so Justin replaced him. It occurs to me, none of that... Nothing about it. Lucky for us, the sunshine logs. <laughs> Hold on. There's a romantic rival somewhere in, oh, in the neighborhood. I'm going to go swimming in the creek with my clothes on. Just immediately into high energy mode. Yeah, that's because it's a, uh, what is it? A chemical compound of GHB. Okay, RoboCop. What a stupid cop to reference. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kick the driver's side. Is it? Yeah. I can't even pretend to be surprised. You fire off 10 rounds and do a... Re- mm. I'm driving away. Oh, I got, I'm trying to do it like her. 17. I don't know what the swim thing was. <laughs> well, you, you do go in the pool. Oh, okay. So that works. So that's perfect. I'm going to weave in and out of traffic recklessly. <laughs> like the reckless part was just a good idea I had at the tail end of it. Uh, wow. Well. <laughs> yeah, well, I forgot, like, I exist. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're, like you're breaking into the house. Yeah. Well, I went. <laughs> Nobody ever says pen me in. You'd think you'd hear that more. It's more permanent. I'd rather be penned in than penciled in. Yeah. Unless it's one of those pens that have the erasers. Well, if you've got one of those, we've got other problems. (laughs) What does that mean? I don't know. Like, sir, you're under arrest. Like, no, no, listen, I'm a lifeguard. (laughs) Yeah, just hang (laughs) on a second. I'm saving you. Who robbed the store? Because. (laughs) (laughs) Who's robbing what? Who's doing a robbery? They better not be taking the cheese. I almost bought a book when I was on vacation in Tennessee. It was called uh, Bear Gags, I think. It was like Reader's Digest style, and I read one story. And this park ranger was like, I saw a lady dancing with a bear, and I panicked. Well, I went to McDonald's, but no one... (laughs) So I ran over there, and the explanation was she was feeding a bear vanilla wafers out of her mouth. And the only thought I had was, don't run out of vanilla wafers, lady. (laughs) Fun fact, the guy who left his debit card behind at the robbery, his name was Lance. (laughs) Get this, L-A-N-T-Z. What? Mostly I'm fortunate that I've been able to ignore the coordinates. I got a history of being insubordinate, but what if he was gonna be when the fortune hits? Like, dang. He said he would do it and he really did it, he really committed The kid wasn't kidding, we should've listened instead of calling him a degenerate Been independent, I'm into administering a percentage of them in a dome I'm winning attention again and again and I got him grinning when I enter the room Bringing the bone, 
one of a kind I'm not here to change your mind I'm here to remind you to find in the fire inside you Is what's gonna keep you alive Baby like yo, ain't you like 35 years old How you been living with the flow so cold I tell them that I keep warm with my alchemist fire I stay warm with my alchemist fire Baby like yo, ain't you like 35 years old How you been living with the flow so cold I tell them that I keep warm with my alchemist fire Stay warm with my alchemist fire